thank the Maker. It's a relief to see someone who isn't one of those... monsters. Please, for the love of all that's good, let me out. I couldn't stand another minute with these creatures. I'm not one of them! I haven't gotten the disease, or whatever it is. They kept you alive. That's odd. And what's a human doing down here anyway? Oh, I overheard Colbert talking about the chasm, and I thought I'd sneak in past the duck spawn to see if there was any treasure. Well, I... I found something in this place before the duck spawn caught me. You thief! What you have belongs to the dwarven people. Well, they worked here to defend it. It's not stealing if they've abandoned it. You can have it if you let me out. I don't want it anymore. It's caused nothing but trouble. I... I'm not sure, but he looks valuable. I've got a nose for these things, trust me. Come on, all I want is to get out of here. Please, no! Sends many, but does not come himself. He is a coward. I will kill him, and he will know that he has failed to destroy the love. He will know that the mother will tear him apart. <laughs> <laughs> Is he planning? You will die, as all who serve the architect will die. The mother demands it. of the Legion were alive, I know. I know they would- It's you! You're the Duster who became a Grey Warden. I can't believe it's you. A ring. What is this, a purple? What's curious is that we seem to be caught between two factions of Darkspawn. I've never heard of such a thing. The Darkspawn are by nature vicious, and they have always fought amongst each other. But for there to be two organized factions, this is something else. Good. It's not just me, then. Something has changed in the Darkspawn, and I don't think I like it. Well, it's something to ponder. Especially when you need to be reminded that impending doom is always right around the corner. Oh, I'll probably disappear into the bowels of the Deep Roads, never to be seen again. One good thing about the Deep Roads is that you never run out of Darkspawn to fight. Go? With you? But... That would go against my vow, and my plan to disappear into the deep, unmourned, and forgotten. Be a Grey Warden? Is that allowed? Can you be both part of the Legion and a Grey Warden? And I'd be more effective at killing the Darkspawn, won't I? Ha! Huh, how does one say no to this? I will follow you. You seem an alright sort, and I'll be better off with you at my back than alone. Let's go then, the Darkspawn await. Herald, lost, the lost is lost, 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 lost. Mother, be calm. Calm, yes. Once I was calm. Once Mother listened to the beautiful call, felt it wash over her and inside her. 
and she was calm. But now there is no calm. Father took that away. And now he takes away Cal Hero. My poor pets in Cal Hero. The father knew I would send them against him. The father feared. <laughs> is gone, but the mother still has her tricks. Many, many tricks. But what will the mother do? Do? I will laugh! <laughs> There was a mouser in the tower named Mr. Wiggums. Only company I had when the Templars locked me up. Miss that beast a lot sometimes. But I can't keep a cat. We fight Darkspawn for a living. I suppose. Well, I'll keep him just for a while, until I find somewhere safer. Is that okay with you, Kitty? I'll call you Sir Pounce a lot. You can stay in my pack. Just for a little while, yes? Psst. Psst. Warden. Horian is content to let me craft away in obscurity under dreadful conditions. Never a care for the art. The art of crafting. But you, you're not so dreadfully common. Exactly. I want to make wondrous things, things a dwarf and craftsman would appreciate. If you come across any fantastical materials, could you perhaps visit old Wade? Wade, what are you about? Oh, nothing, nothing. Remember, fantastical materials. Yes, Commander? I simply must do something with this. So unique, so rare. Yes, a breastplate. Here, take this. These are a few knickknacks I need to begin my work. Find them soon. I simply cannot wait. You're back. You need anything? Oh, <laughs> this will help a great deal. This is iron. Very high quality. Armor and weapons could be made with this. Commander, if you like, we could outfit your men. It wouldn't cost you anything, but some soldiers would have to guard the miners. So I'm to make armor for all Amaranthine's rabble? Heron, you abuse me so. It's unconscionable. Commander's orders. Fine, fine, I'll work. But I want a challenge one day. Something to sink my teeth into. You arranged for quite the welcome for us, didn't you, Commander? Not that I mind. <laughs> Gave me a chance to do some proper testing. <laughs> oh, kind of you to notice. I that was my work. The name is Dworkin Glavenock. Some call me Dworkin the Mad. That don't ruffle my beard, though. <laughs> Have to be a little mad in my line of research. <laughs> I developed these particular formulations. It's the Kunari who perfected the art. That just gets in my craw. Sullen, ashen-skinned giants shouldn't be allowed to outsmart dwarves. So, I've been conducting experiments on lyrium sand and other volatile ingredients. If you got a mind to, hi. We used up all the explosives on those dark spawn. I can make more, but I'm out of lyrium sand. Lyrium dust is all over the place, but that's too fine. Dust's good for fuses, but not the boom I'm looking for. 
With real larium sand, I can set the lads to work. Wonderful. We can start making more explosives. Warden, before you let my brother blow himself to little bitsies, tell him to be careful. Don't listen to Foldrick. I know what I'm about. And how many apprentices have you lost? Three? No, four? We all know the risks. If we succeed, our names will go down in history. Aye, Commander. Thanks for your help. Please, take these. Use them to give those beasties a what for. <laughs> Grass smells good, too. And flowers, of course. The surface is full of such wonderful smells. In the deep roads, all you smell is moist rock or dry earth. And darkspawn. There's a smell I won't miss. Unfortunately. Ugh, the only thing worse than the smell of darkspawn is the smell of broodmothers. Now there's a foulness that cannot be described. But trees? Trees smell good. Out of my way! I need to get out of here! No! No one can help me! I just need to get out of here! Uh, the elf! She makes the trees come alive. All we wanted was some easy money from the caravans, but we... Make her help me. She's here. Gotta get away. I recall you from the last gathering of the clans. Your keeper is Marathari, is she not? I was with our keeper, Ilshe, when she spoke to Marathari. I am Valana. Watch your back around these parts. They're a dark spawn, and the Shem settlements do not look kindly on the Dalish. I have a score to settle with the Shems, who march through as though the woods were theirs. They stole my sister, and likely sold her to merchants. I will not rest until I have her back! You should go. I have no quarrel with you, and I would hate for that to change. There's dried blood all over this camp. And those discarded weapons, why are they just lying there? There's something strange going on here. I'm not sure I like it. It has been a long time. I have forgotten my name, but I am a warrior. I am Avar, and I am cursed. Far longer than that. Seasons beyond counting, I was a man, a man to be feared, a man of war. The Deventer mages, they came here seeking easy prey, but they found me, my brother, my tribe. We broke their army at the fort of a thousand vigils, then pursued the Magister. Perhaps time changes all things. We cornered the Magister here. Here we would sacrifice him to Yuvola, the god of this wood. As his guards fell one by one, he struck my brother and I with liquid fire. So even as the Magister's body was torn apart, my brother and I Watched from stone eyes. So much forgotten. I remember only revenge. The Tevinter Magister that cursed my brother and I, he leads a mockery of life. Disturb the ashes nearby. Summon him. Kill him. Free me. Stranger. No, 
come here. My brother called to you. Do not listen. The Magister's death will accomplish nothing. Humor. I remember humor. My brother is consumed by rage. Over long years, his anger grows. Anger will not free us. Revenge will not free us. I've used the long years to think, to pray to our gods. There is no release, but with peace, serenity, we can sleep. I have slept many seasons with only my brother's anger to call me back. Show him the way. This does not have to be a torment. With reason or a silver tongue. He is the son of the father, a warrior born. With the long seasons, I have seen that violence often accomplishes naught. Teach him. The deed is not yet done. My brother has grown weak. In truth, weakness was always in him. He was a thinker, a dreamer, not a warrior. This life of Earth is beyond bearing. The Magister stirs from his ashes, and my blood boils. He yet lives! What you ask is difficult. My soul calls out to smite he who cursed my brother and me. I... I will try. It will take time. You... you have calmed him. If it lasts, perhaps we can sleep and wake in a brighter future. Thank you. Before I sleep, let me whisper to you of Law of the Earth, our secret herbs. May they help you, stranger. Good night. You're standing in my dirt. Don't be sorry, just move. That dirt was specially prepared for my plants. I only have to find the seeds now. It's just a matter of time, I'm sure. You've heard of me then? Read one of my books, have you? Win? What now? She's not going to try to get me to teach slack-jawed apprentices again, is she? She used to pester Uldred about his duty to the apprentices, when he just wanted to be left alone. No wonder he went crazy and tried to kill everyone. And she told you to find me? Huh. She must be clutching at straws. Hmm, it's been some time since the college was called together. Why now? No, I can't go. Not yet. I'm not leaving till I get the seeds of the northern prickleweed. I've been here too long just to give up. Hmm, I suppose another pair of eyes wouldn't hurt. And if you actually succeed, I'm sure I could scrounge up some kind of reward. You're looking for the seeds of a northern prickleweed. The plant has broad, dark green leaves with thorny stems and is most commonly found growing on rocky ground. Go on now. If I'm going to be traveling, I'll need to make preparations. Any luck? Did you find any northern prickleweed? Marvelous! Look at them! Oh, magnificent! Such a smooth seed coat! Like onyx! You, my friend, are a worker of miracles. Here, I whipped up some herbal remedies for you, and a list of instructions so you can recreate them if you like.
And now it's time for me to leave. Perhaps our paths will cross again at a later date. Good luck. <laughs> Don't look. Don't look at me. Olaf, my name. Came with friends to to drive out away the elf, but the dark spawn were too quick. We were ripped apart, biting claws and teeth from the darkness, and then I woke, flesh and bone and gristle under me, around me. Everyone dead. Dead, soft meat melting into the ground. I, I crawled away, came here. Can't stand to see it. Sister? I have a sister. Do I? Elf sister? No, we did not take her. Probably dead or eaten. No. No. Darkspawn came first. They slaughtered us, took our steel, brought it to the elven camp, tricked us, tricked the elf. Now, she thinks we are to blame. Hunts all in her rage while they watch. So all these people died over a misunderstanding? Maker, that's horrible. We have to stop her. Tell her she's wrong. Do you think she's back at her camp? We could try looking for her there. The Dark Ones are curious about you too. They watch you as well as her. Can you feel them? I'm already dead. I'm already gone. Make... make an end. Please. Can the Dalish hope to revive our past glory when we slaughter each other like animals? Then will you let me go? For the sake of our people and what we share? <laughs> Talk. What? The Darkspawn are mindless. It is not possible. They should never have come here in the first place. If they had just left us alone, all this would never have happened. If it wasn't the humans who killed my people and took Sarani, are you saying the Darkspawn did it? That is Sarani's. She would never willingly part with that. Our mother gave it to her before she died. Why would the Darkspawn do this? Are you saying Sarani will become one of them? I will not allow that. You? You want to find Sarani? Why? We Dalish must band together. I apologize for my actions. Now, where should we seek the Darkspawn? There is an abandoned mine, some ways to the north of here. The tunnels run far into the earth. We will likely find the dark spawn there.
So you are the commander of the Grey Wardens. Do not be frightened. Your injuries have been tended to. I apologize for what I must do. I do not wish to be your enemy. But now is not the time for this. Rest. Are you all right? You have to understand, he's not trying to hurt you. You know Valana? Where is she? Yes, I know she must be worried, but she wouldn't understand. It's, it's complicated. I don't have time to explain. I have to get you out before something bad happens. I don't want anyone else to be hurt. The Darkspawn have your things. You can still get it all back if you're careful and clever. They're going to come back to check on you. You have to hurry. I don't know anything, but take this key. It, it opens a chest in the Emissary's room. Maybe you'll find some answers there. They're coming! You have to go! Find a way out of the mines! Please! Hey! That's mine! That thing has my things! It's got its sallow, clammy hands all over my doodads, touching my junk! No one touches Argrin's junk and lives! You're the Warden Commander. I would not have expected to meet you here. Did those bastards get you too? I had hoped you would avoid capture. Would be luckier than the rest of us. I was to help rebuild the Ferelden Wardens, just as you were. We were at Vigil's Keep less than a week when the Darkspawn came. I think I'm the only one left. The others are dead, or worse. I'm not sure. The emissary who leads them is more cunning than any Darkspawn I've encountered. He's fascinated with Wardens. But listen, there is a Darkspawn here carrying a huge maul. He crushed my legs. He took my wedding ring. Please, Commander, slay him. Bring the ring to my wife Nida in Amaranthine. Tell her I died trying to make this world better. Thank you, Commander. I make her turn his gaze on you. You are not supposed to be here. Once. I made a deal with the creatures, and they set me free. I bring them supplies, they give me gold. Vigil's Keep? Hmm. That is the Grey Warden's Keep near Amaranthine. Yes, I know it. If there is coin to be had, Armas will be there. We will meet again, if you survive this place.